I'm here at Jones Technical Institute, and today I'm going to be demonstrating the breaking structure uh, of this track. It's important to follow the plan of fact and the specification when we're doing this. This particular, like I said, is a trailer, so it's not a truck, but we're just going to be doing a demonstration on that. First, I need to take the wheel off. The wheel is the tire off here, and uh, I'm going to do that. We'll be right back. Okay, so I'll take the tire off, and what we need to do after we take the tire off is we're going to put the slide right off here. Okay, I'm Type of damage. Any type of damage needs to be replaced. Chip, broken, needs to be replaced. Holding the shoe together, we have one of our springs. These springs that sit in there, if you can see that. We have springs that sit in there. It holds that shoe together from top and bottom. There. Also, springs on this side. Okay. And then we have our, which, which connect from the shoes is to the S-cam, our rollers here, we can inspect our rollers. That was the roller. S-cam, it needs to be greased, there's a good amount of grease there on there. And the S cam housing. And this is the shield behind the S cam. And we're coming over to from the S cam housing to the spider. And that's what's actually what the entire assembly is mounted upon. And we're coming back from the S cam housing to what is known as the slack adjustment. So, okay, since 1994, they've been automatic slack adjusters and we want to make sure they are, are in spec when we're being this, when we are inspecting those if this is on a particular truck. Also what we want to make sure too is our lines that connect to the brake pedal airline are in good condition and also that that brake chamber is properly caged when we are inspecting those brakes on the vehicle. We also want to make sure that this vehicle, as you see on the side here, that we have it jacked up on stands, not on a jack, to properly do that. All right, and that was how to do the brake inspection. Uh, uh, here at John Taylor Institute, and uh, thanks for watching.